Okay, so we're cleaning peppers. And uh, they're on sale, so we got a whole bunch of peppers. So I'm just going to freeze them. Right now I'm just cleaning them, so this video will be about cleaning peppers. And this is how I do it. See, so when you're done, you know, when you got this guy here, cut this, cut this, and then you have this nice long strip. Then the strip you can take, you always don't cut it this way because it's too hard. Your knife always goes through this way easy. And then I cut it in strips, whatever size I wish. And uh, that works. It's good. And then you end up with nice strips, right? So, what I do, I take pepper and I just cut it about a half inch in, right? I got that piece there. I take this one, cut about a maybe three quarters of an inch. And I got that piece there, a little leprechaun piece. piece. And uh, I'll take these and I'll, I'll just put it in another bowl for now and I'll cut that later. And this guy, I'll just pop this off right here, All right? Just break these off, whatever. And uh, get rid of this stem. And cut the white part out. I don't want that. It's not tasty. The pith, whatever you want to call it, the inside. Of and then, uh, so I have these, which are useful. And I'll put them in another bowl. So then I got the pepper, right? It still has some seeds. So I'll just slice it right down like that. Just like that. Well, that's a little baby one. I love eating those. And then I'll, you know, I'll try to open it a little bit. Just like that. I'll take the seeds out. Throw them in a bowl. Throw them in a bowl. Whatever I can get my hands on. The seeds out. Then I'll take my knife. And I'll run it on the side of it, or on the bottom, and I'll just cut that white out. That's that's the bitter part. Right, that's the membrane. Nobody likes the membrane. Do the same thing for this guy here. Just like that. And that's how you clean a green pepper. And it'll taste much better when you cook with it. And then you have the, the length piece right here. See? So, right, now you cut it whatever strips you want, however thick. And I always do strips. Works out fine. Like that. Then same thing with the other side. That's how you clean uh, pepper. Now I'm going to show you another way how to clean a pepper. And this is a different way. So this just do the same thing. Cut that. Then you cut the back end. And you save those. Back end. Then you can take your knife and you can put it inside here and just trim it while you go around in a circle. Well, the reason why I don't like doing this, I can't really see inside, so I do it the other way, but this works too. Some people like it better. Then when you do that, you go all around. You're all done there. So you got all, all the garbage out. Then, if you didn't have circles, you have the whole thing to do. You could stuff that with food. You could stuff it with anything, right? And it's it's a nice little little venue to use. So then you can cut it like that. You can still see, see there's still some here. So I don't always get all that I want to when I do it that way. But it still works and it's effective. So whatever way you feel comfortable with, there's two ways to, to uh, clean a pepper, and those are the two ways, so, thanks. Now, if you want to make stuffed peppers, you're going to cut the top right off, and you're going to keep this top, right, because you're going to want to put it back on when you're done, make it look nice while it's cooking. So, in here you're going to do the same thing, but you got still got the bottom, so you don't want to mess with that, because that's going to hold all your stuffing and filling in. So you just cut around. All the innards. Cut the membranes out of the side. And just pick it out. I mean, yeah, it's common sense. Pretty much easy, right? Very simple. And you clean it out with your fingers. And uh, make sure you get the membrane out, the white part, because that's bitter. A little more bitter than the other part, so. 
I don't like leaving it in there. You want to leave it in there, leave it in there. I don't care. I want to clean it nice. And then you have it uh, all ready for your stuffing. It goes right in there, right? Easy, simple, done. It's another way to clean it back. And you just stuff it whatever. A little, um, you know, maybe some chopped meat and some rice. Done. A little uh, herbs and spices. Okay, thanks.